As we grow older, we strive to improve ourselves and our future. However, we must also acknowledge the fact that the preceding generations are indeed our future. It is crucial that we elaborate a relationship with them, not only to ensure a safe, stable, and sustainable future for ourselves, but to also encourage them to be involved and participate in a world that will surpass ours and become their own. This is one of the primary goals of Italy Starts and Italy Reads, two programs here at JCU that intend on bridging the gap between undergraduate and high school students while simultaneously creating a global arena of sorts in which we can culturally exchange ideas between an American university and Italian high schools. Italy Starts is a unique program from both the perspective of the mentor and the mentee. As a mentor, I was challenged to engage and inform the mentees about the context and importance of startups. The beautiful thing about this program is that you can visually recognize the moment in which the mentees become proud of their own work and become fully committed to their project. There is an instance in which the language barrier is no longer an inhibition and the mentee and the mentor become two sides of the same coin. Between the first day of brainstorming to the last day in which the students present their projects, there is an exponential growth within the students, both in confidence and in the knowledge that they've gained from the experience. But there is also a growth for the mentors. The ideology of growth and connection flows throughout JCU and especially into the sister program of Italy Starts which is Italy Reads. Although this program strives to connect the students from the American University to Italian high schools through English literature instead of business marketing and the idea of startups, it is still a great way to create a bond between these two cultures just trying to get to know one another. On a personal note, these two programs helped me in adjusting to my life here in Italy. I was able to learn about the culture, the language and history from this country's youngest generation which is a perspective that I will never take for granted. Their curiosity and desire for change is something that's quite tenacious. And in this day and age where we're fighting against global climate change, I believe it is this characteristic that is most necessary to carry with us.